Hey everybody, welcome back. So today is part two of our two-part introductory series on interfaces. Interfaces are a complex topic, and this is something that not every CS1 course covers. But one of the reasons that we do talk about it is because they are so important. And there's also a real conceptual uh, bit of understanding here to, to start to learn about. Um, one of the things I want to point out, which is true of, of our course, but really of all learning, is that you know, this is not the last time you're going to see some of the ideas. But people think, well, you know, I learned it in this class. No, you didn't. Uh, you learned part of it. You saw it for the first time, and then you may see this again in a later class, and then again in a later class, and at some point it's going to start to kind of come together. You also work with them, and that's going to help you understand the idea as well. Um, but we do bring you here because it's so important, and interfaces exist in so many different parts of, of real computer systems, so it's a really fun thing to talk about. Um, hopefully today's lesson also helps clarify a little bit of yesterday's content because you know using and providing interfaces are two very different things and sometimes you really can't see both sides until you've talked about both sides so we'll look at things from one direction and then back across the fence and hopefully that'll clear things up a little bit for you so good luck on today's lesson um, I will see you at the bottom